everything is like party 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 hi guys it's lily and welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be filming an assumptions video as you can see by the title but it's with a little twist it is a college edition assumptions video as in assume things about me as I go into college because it's going to be my freshman year at Saginaw Valley State University in like a month. <laughs> so I asked you guys this on Instagram about a week ago, I think it was, two weeks ago, I don't really know. It was before Blake filmed his, let's just say that. Yeah, it was July 21st, I asked you guys. Okay, the very first one is that you are going to get a fake ID. Um, no, I've also heard that they are expensive and I am the type, if I'm going to do that, I'm scared, like, I would laugh, like, I've just said, like, so many times, but I really would just ruin it for myself and I look like I'm, like, 15, so I don't think that would work for me anyway. Someone assumed that I'm going to be the life of the party, I always am. So yes, you're right. Abby White assumed that I'm going in undecided. That is false. Let's get to the other ones because the other ones will answer that. Glenda assumed that you're studying something in the government field. That it is also false. I took AP Gov this year. I didn't even take the AP test because I'm so not into government. Um, I took it because the teacher at my school that teaches it is so amazing and they do really fun things in the class and it actually like low-key made me want to be a lawyer but I know since I hated government class I wouldn't be able to do that but yeah so that is a big no for me I don't know anything about government like it just doesn't interest me so when I like learn it it's just like it doesn't stay in my brain if that makes sense nia assumed that i will be a business major and ding 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 correct um a lot of people say that you switch your major up like three or four times throughout college so this might not be my official major when i graduate and stuff but as of now i'm going in to business my prom date said so you're going to dance on some tables to Cyclone. And that is probably true. That is my favorite song to dance to if you don't know that. Thanks, Luke. Someone responded that you're going to be living at college. That is correct. Um, my college is two hours away from me, so I kind of don't have a choice. Um, I am going to be living on campus my first year. And to be honest, I think I might do it my second year too. I don't know, obviously, yet. But... I feel like I'm gonna really like being on campus and getting involved in stuff a lot, so... Carly assumed that I'm going to a cheap college. That is actually true. Um, I didn't like do it on purpose, but it is a very good thing that I fell in love with a school that's so cheap. I think it's like 21000 a year for tuition and stuff, but that is one of the cheapest in Michigan. So, I'm pretty, pretty glad about that. Brooke said, you're probably making your parents pay for all of it. That is false. Um, I got quite a bit of scholarships for my grades and just filling out applications for scholarships, but also um, every penny of my graduation money is going towards my tuition. Parents made my sister do that, so I didn't really have a choice either. Um, but honestly, it's a good thing. I think my parents are paying for like my books and stuff, but yeah, that's about it. And I'm like so thankful that I have parents that if I do need them to pay for me, they will try and pay as much as they can. So. Um, thanks mom and dad. This isn't even about college, but someone said you like Khalid, and that is 100% true. He actually came to Detroit yesterday, and I didn't go to the concert, so I'm mad about that. You will hide a boyfriend from your viewers. 
I mean, if I get a boyfriend, I don't know. But, like, I don't really want a boyfriend right now, so... I'm not hiding anyone from you guys. Let's just say that. Someone said that... Someone assumed that I think sororities are expensive and a waste of time. Um... I don't think that. My sister is actually in a sorority and my stepsister. Um, and they look really good on like job applications and stuff since you do so much philanthropy. So I don't think that. Marley said you're excited but nervous. That is a hundred percent me. I am so excited. Like sometimes I'm just like I want to be in college already. Like I just want to go there and like start and just be independent. But I am nervous because there's no one from my grade at my school that I know of at least going to Saginaw Valley. As in, I don't know anybody. I'm scared to make friends, but every time I've told someone that, they're like, no, you're so outgoing and like, you're so good at making friends. You're, so, you're like so talkative and stuff. One, I don't really think I'm that outgoing, but um, I hope so. And I don't even know my roommate yet. Like, I know who she is. We Snapchat all the time. Stuff like that. But, like, I really don't know anyone, like, already. If that makes sense. So that's what I'm nervous about. I think I'm also a little nervous that I'm going to have to go to class. And I won't have anyone to, like, make me go to class. But I don't have any early classes, so... Personally, I think I'm all good on that, but like thinking about it sometimes scares me. Keisha said, your dorm room theme is pink. That is correct. My comforter I got is actually like a pink, peachy color thing. I don't, I honestly don't really know how to explain it, but pink's my favorite color, so yes. India said, you're going because you're being forced to continue school. That is not true. I mean, no one's forcing me, but also, like, everyone just knows that I would always go to school. Like, it never came out, like, no one ever talked about me not going to school, if that makes sense. Olivia said, you'll come home every weekend. No, I have, like, set my mind to not coming home because I know some people will come home every weekend. They don't get, like, involved in the campus, so they don't really feel like their school is like their second home, I guess you'd say. Um, and I really don't want that to happen to me because I really want to just love my school and like want to be there all the time. So I don't think I'm going to be coming home every weekend. Kira said you're going to be on most of the school teams. I'm not playing any sports in college. I might play like intramural like volleyball and stuff, but... Yeah, that's it. I'm not going in with any sports. Christy said, you're going to go to a lot of parties. Um, yeah, probably. Someone said that you were going to join a sorority. I am thinking about rushing. I, well, I know I'm, I'm going to rush, but I'm not 100% that, like, I'm going to love it. So, I'm just going in with an open mindset and if I don't find something that I love, if I don't think I'm really going to like it, then I'm not going to join a sorority. But as of now, yes, I am going to rush. Someone said you will have lots of boyfriends. Hee hee hee. Who knows? I'm <laughs> just kidding, probably not. Juliana said you will have a 4.0 GPA. Um, I hope so. Like, that would be phenomenal for me, but I finished school, like, I finished high school with a 3.6. Okay, but I do blame my freshman and sophomore self for that, but still, I, if I did high school at 3.6, I'm hoping to just, like, continue that. If I get a 4.0, though, that would be great. That's the goal. Someone said, you're gonna party every day. No, as I said, I am going to go to parties, like, it's my first time, like, I want to get the college experience, I guess you'd say, and, like, go out, have fun, I'm not going to have parents telling me what to do, but I'm at school to study, I'm at school to get good grades, I'm not spending $21,000 to go to parties, if you know what I mean, like, like, I'm paying for going to school, 
and also like partying could like interfere with that so i'm gonna just say no to that one sarah said you go to frat parties a lot i went to two frat parties with my sister you guys didn't even know that i bet actually i put it on my snapchat story so you probably did someone said you're not actually gonna work out every day um yeah i'm not gonna work out every day in college like i can already say like even now i don't work out every day um i do work out quite a bit but not every day so in college it's even gonna be busier but the good thing i'm gonna get a free gym because i go to the school i'm excited about that the, the like lifting area is super nice someone said your butt is fake that's false that doesn't have to do with college though sorry i'm assuming that you'll be very successful in college but you'll also have fun yeah i like that one that one's true you're majoring in something that has to do with helping people i mean if business helps people <laughs> everything is like party 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 Bryce Stevens said, you hate partying so much you'd rather stay in. Yes. Okay, that is it for this video. I really hope that answered some of your questions and that you like get to know me a little bit more. I am so excited for this month of August because one, I'm starting college, obviously. I move in the 22nd, so I'm excited because a dorm room haul like all my stuff that i have bought i'm gonna do a haul for you guys i'm gonna do a move-in vlog because i have watched like hundreds of those that's all i watch on youtube anymore i feel like i don't know i'm just so excited about school videos now that i'm in college so uh, i really am excited well i hope you liked the video if you did give a big thumbs up comment down below what school you're going to or what grade you're going into that's a good one if you have any college videos that you would like me to film before i go i feel like i'm on crack right now i'm so like hyper subscribe turn on my post notifications and peace